welcome back to this week, well no, this week's first episode, because there are two now, I keep forgetting that, of Survival of the Yoshi in the last episode. If you guys remember, which I would be worried if you didn't because it was last episode, we were working, that's a really weird sand spawn there, that's really strange. We were working on this glass house, I was about to say where is it, because I haven't put glowstone in yet. We're working on this glass house and loads of you guys in the comment section, you had some really cool ideas. And uh, one that I am going to do, which is a long term goal, because I think it will take quite a while, is I'm actually going to connect this world, well not world, but this location to my main mountain network via rail. So yeah, I say long term goal because Holy crap, that is going to be a hell of a lot of mine tracks and just everything, so we'll get around to that eventually. Another idea you guys had that is actually what I'm going to be trying to do today, or one of the things I'm going to be doing today, is making a tunnel to, from this part of the land to there, and that was kind of on my mind anyway, but you guys had some cool ideas. So I am going to do it with glass again, and I'm going to basically have it all lit up so it'll look really good. Also, I realised last episode I didn't actually fill this side in here. I didn't realise, and I haven't cleared out the water just yet. I am going to do that this episode, that is the other thing we were going to do, but I'm going to do that off camera, just because I think it's a very, kind of, tedious thing, to a certain extent, and god damn it, it's dark again and I can't see anything, and I'm going to take damage now, so that's great. Can I break that glass? No, I can't! Okay! So we're going to connect this tunnel here, so let's just do this right now. I probably won't have enough glass to do it, I'm just saying. I'm going to do the roof of it though, because then I'll know kind of where to base it around. So, I'll have it go three out, and then any cobblestone I place will just be like a marker, by the way, just a heads up. So, don't worry, I'm not making it look awful. I can build okay things. Not fantastic things, I don't have that ability, but I can I can build okay things. It does mystify me, although, at some points, like, when people just build the most realistic things in Minecraft, I'm like, this is a block game, how do you do that? I do. Especially speaking of, well, there's, actually, there's so many now, but one of the first was, of course, like, Fire UK, like, my... Just how, 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 how the hell do you do that? So, this isn't, like, a walkway, guys. This is going to be the roof and then it will like curve around, but I thought instead of, you know, just drowning all the time, because we did enough of that last episode, instead of drowning all the time, I will just place the roof down and I'll do the rest off camera, I think. And at the same time when I do that, I will also uh, just clear out all the water in that location because... Yeah, that's going to be a tedious thing and I'm dreading it. And I, I told you, I did warn you, I do not have enough glass. I knew that was a fact. And I still carried on. I guess I'm a dick. Although I do have four to complete it. So there you go. That's going to be as high as it goes up. I think I'll make it like four down. So it'll be... Yeah, that's perfect actually. Because look, four down is right on top of the water there. So it will carry along. You'll jump up onto it. And then you will walk your way down. And it'll be beautiful. So we are only four minutes or so into the episode. And I'm already doing a cut. I know I'm providing you guys with the best amount of content that I probably can. He says sarcastically. No, I'm going to go and do that really, really quick. And I will also remove all the air pockets. So I'll actually be back in like half an hour. For you guys, it will be like one second. So screw you. You guys are lucky. And until then, Yoshi had... Tran Yoshi had? Yoshi had transition kapow. There's my finger snapping to cue it. Whoosh. Yeah, I don't need a sound effect. I've got one. Good. Okay, we're back. I cleared everything out. We're all good to go. I made a couple of adjustments to the tunnel as well, as I would like to finish that on camera now. We'll see. Uh, so I finished the last side of the glass. I got it all cooked. I finished the last side, and I, when I said, you know, oh yeah, I'll be back in 30 minutes, I was being sarcastic. I didn't mean it actually happened, had to happen. Well, it did, so yeah, that took a while clearing out all the air, but we are done. Hopefully, I have enough glass left to finish up this. I probably don't, but whatever. Anyway, let me give you a quick rundown, I guess, then. Uh, we need to... Again, cobble is just like a placeholder, but we need to get some floors down here. I did kind of the entrance just to get an idea and remind myself of what it's going to be like. And get these steps done as well, because these were too high, as you can see. I need to I need to fix that. We'll get to that later. I don't think that's priority right now. Priority right now is... Uh, I thought I saw a zombie just run across there really far. That's... I'm guessing it was a cactus, but that still really creeps me out. Don't know why. It's really weird. Anyway... 
This is what we're looking for here. Just keep building the floor, and we've got to clear out all of this water too. And oh god, I've cleared out enough water to last a freaking lifetime. I'm not even kidding. I am done with clearing the goddamn. Well, there's not even a glass bit there, so of course it's not going to stop it. Any bits of cobblestone that I place down, I'm just going to say as like not necessary right now. And then we'll fill them with glass right, like, uh, eventually. Just because I think getting the floor down itself so we can walk into the base. Seeing as we have limited glass right now, and I used up all my sand as well. Is kind of more important. Just my opinion, you know, whatever. People can have different opinions. Wow, don't rage at me, oh my god. Uh, is that... I tried to remember. I, I fixed the roof so we wouldn't bump our heads. I was just trying to figure out if that was fine to break. Okay, it was. Good, good, good. Right, one more down here. And then more glass, and then, oh yeah, you guessed it, goddamn, more cobblestone, because, you know, I can't wait to do that. It's great. Love clearing air. I mean, it's, it, you probably don't even think it sounds that bad, and I'm guessing, you know, it probably doesn't. Try doing it for like half an hour, just repeatedly. Cobblestone, placing down, breaking it, placing it down, breaking it, placing it down, breaking it. Ugh. It's fine, we're good. Whatever, it's fine. Actually, you know, if we place this right, the cobblestone could actually look okay there. Like, it'd be like a, like a... I'm trying to think of the word, like a border or like a line just on the bottom layer of glass there. I don't know. Let's give it a go. We'll see what we think a bit later. Ugh, no, see, now I'm getting sucked into the house. Oh, jeez. Yeah, so I'll show you the house in a minute. I actually want to finish this straight up now. Hopefully I don't drown doing it. Fingers crossed. I don't think I will. I think I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Got to play it safe, you know? Play the game. Oh, wait, does that go down again? Nope, we're fine there, but... Oh, my God! This water is rage-tastic. Oh, right, it's because I hadn't... I'm so hopped up! I thought I cleared it up on this level, but I, I obviously didn't. I mean, obviously, so... That sucks. Oh, have I screwed myself now? No, no, I'm fine. Okay. I thought... Because when you're underwater, as you guys know, you know, you chop blocks a lot slower. That also made clearing the air uh, hellish times three for the first couple of layers. But uh, I thought I screwed myself there, and I didn't. I was fine. Screwing yourself is bad. You you can you can screw other people. That's that's better. That was a dirty joke, and now I feel bad. So let's not say that again. It's okay. You know we can come back from that. Ugh, cobblestone. No, not even cobblestone there. I placing it wrong now. I mean it's placing cobblestone. It's not that hard. Cobblestone. Glass. It's like rinse and repeat every single step you ever do. Uh, although, actually, you know, that looks kind of cool when you're, like, in the air bubble and you can kind of see underwater. That looks quite cool. I like that. Yeah, they, there you go. There's our sweet spot. That looks quite cool. I don't know why. I don't know. I just... I'm a Minecraft nerd, and you guys probably are too, so... You guys should think it looks cool as well. That's all I'm saying. If you don't think it looks cool, you're not a true Minecraft... No, that's, that's not real. That's fake. Oh, God, is it... Really? Really? What a noob. Fine, I'll do that, and then that, and then that, and that'll do it. And oh, now my pickaxe broke, and now I can't break it. Ah, oh, that's a, that's a total screw over. Now I've just got to swim up, and I've got to fix that again. God, that sucks. Do I have any more cobblestone even left? I don't. Maybe I have some in my chest. I need to check that, because I need to make another tool. I might have iron in my chest, actually. Fingers crossed I do for that as well. I'm saying fingers crossed a lot. And I've noticed that recently, and I'm trying to stop saying it, but it's just not happening. I don't know why, fingers crossed. See, I did it again. Well, okay, fine. That was one purpose for comedic effect. You know, a bit of comedy relief every now and then doesn't hurt. But, I also say but quite a lot. Oh, yeah, plus four attack damage. Look at that plus seven. Oh, it's beautiful. Plus all the, uh, all the beautiful enchantments on there. I love it. Do I have any more cobblestone? Yes, I have quite a lot, actually. I forgot we went caving, didn't we? I totally forgot about the caving trip. How did I forget about that? That was made... What, how many episodes ago was that? Two? Maybe even one? No, I think it was two. Yeah, because the first, last episode we did all of this, didn't we? Two? And I've already forgotten what I'm doing. I'm a great Minecrafter. It's a fun fact. There you go. Okay. Let's chop this down again. This is the most riveting gameplay ever, but you know, every now and then, I like to have a bit of realism in my videos, and uh, mining cobblestone in Minecraft, it doesn't get more real than that. That is so damn real, homeboy, you know? Talking talking gangster now. We're stepping the game up. We're, we're misplacing glass twice. That's, that's not good. 
That's actually quite bad. But it's fine. We can come back from this. Guess what I'm going to say next, guys? Take a guess! Fingers crossed we'll do okay. Sorry. I'm just milking it now. It's like when you bring up something you're trying to stop, you kind of have it on your mind to stop it, so I don't have that urge to keep saying it anymore. If that makes any sense whatsoever, which I'm guessing it doesn't. But at the same time, now I kind of want to do it just to be a dick to you guys, just to point something dumb out. Ah, oh, this is the bit of the roof that I didn't fix. So we have to break that. I'm not sure if... No, water's not going to flood through. Okay, we're actually all right. Because all of that was like that, so I just wouldn't be able to go down. Is that I? This way I'm bumping my head, but I don't mind too much about that if right now it's functional. I'm guessing we'll fix that later on, because those are really annoying, but... Right now, it's okay, as long as I can actually go down, but before it was just straight up blocking me, like, right there. So I had to fix all of that, and I thought, you know what, I'll do all of that on camera. And then I got, like, halfway through, and not only did I run out of glass, which did stop me, there we go, okay, that's that's done. Not only did I run out of glass, which yeah, admittedly did stop me, but I thought, you know what, I've got to have some content for this episode. Otherwise, probably screwed, you know? Yeah, probably a little bit screwed. Alright, let's keep on going. We are nearly done with this water clearing, and actually, once I clear this water, there won't be any flooding down from this staircase into my house either, which is great, because that means the last of the water will have been cleared, and God, am I happy enough to have had that go. Okay, any more coming in? Yep, yeah, we've got a couple of bits here. Let's just finish this off like so. Goodbye, Mr. Water. And then one there, and that right there should be the last of the water, and yes it is. I, I, yeah, I just realised I don't have proper steps. Let me place those down as well. Okay, there we go. Now, I said this halfway through, I'm actually going to do this. I am going to place cobblestone all the way along. I think now that I've done it, I think it looks quite good actually. I don't know. It's a waste of glass because I already used it doing here and that sucks. But I think it looks good and sometimes you have to suffer for your looks, as vain women like to say. And I'm twisting that around and applying it to Minecraft apparently, so whatever. It's fine. Right, so let's just place it down here. We will finish this design off. Look at me, I'm actually doing designs in Minecraft. How things have changed back in the day. Uh, how things have changed indeed. Oh, nice. Just noticed there's still some cobble there from when I was breaking it in here to get the air. So there you go, guys. There is our house in its current state. I actually do think it looks quite good. It just looks a bit weird right now because there is no lighting. And we can't place them on the uh, vertical walls. We can only place them on the floor, which is a bit annoying. We will get a much better method. I think I'm probably going to go with glowstone eventually. I think glowstone will look awesome in this place. And we can actually replace some of the glass with it, so it'll be part of the floor, just lit up. I think that'll be quite nice. So that is one thing I do want to do in here. And then we just need to start tunnelling. As I said, I'm going to have kind of different rooms that are linked with tunnels. So we'll basically duplicate what we've got here a couple of times. And then place one in that direction a little bit. One out there. And then have like three wide tunnels just leading over there. And then each of those rooms can then have extensions going on there. It's kind of one of those endless builds that you can just keep expanding onto and have it always look impressive and beautiful. And at the same time be very, very practical. I'm happy with that. I think that's a good thing to have. Practicality is a great thing to have actually. Not just a good thing, a great thing. Let's just finish off the cobblestone here. We, ha we have 20 formal pieces of glass. Let's just place as much of this down as we can. I'm trying not to misplace it. I'm being very careful because that would be annoying. We'll place as much of this down as we can and then we will either finish this off next episode or I will just do it off camera. I don't know, whichever we want to do. So there you go, guys. That is how far we've got. There's a little gap. The tunnel isn't finished yet. But now that it's lit up, let's take a quick look. There are some messy bits of cobblestone underneath as well. And I'm not going to go and do those now because that would require me to just swim under there. Or break glass. And I don't have any more glass left. So no. And that would just be slow and tedious. And I'll do that eventually. Whatever. But there you go. That I think that looks really cool. So I like the cobblestone there. I don't know. You guys can feel free to disagree. If you guys want me to change that back, do tell me. That is all good. Whatever. But I think that looks quite nice. It kind of leads you down. It, you can see where the glass is. And then, of course, we've got our beautiful room, which is now finally lit up, so we can start to see things a little bit better. And from far away, I think that's starting to look pretty cool. 
So guys, I'm going to finish this episode of Survival of the Yoshi off here. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it, guys. Thank you for watching, and until next time, I will see you later. Bye, guys.